Welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Real Madrid in Football Manager 2019. I'm Aether and today it's time for the Spanish Cup Final. And um, I'm going to try to talk a lot less than I normally do because uh, I have picked up a cold. And unfortunately when I get a cold it uh, very often kind of affects my, my voice. It kind of kills my voice. Um, so I can probably speak for like a minute or two, maybe, and then it start, will start cracking up. So um, I need to talk for just short stints, then being quiet some time, so the voice will survive for the whole episode. Um, since last episode, we played two games in the league, but as you already know, the league was won uh, in the last episode. So, so the last few games was just to, to finish things up. We won the league 96 points, so at the end we really pulled, uh, pulled ahead of uh, Atletico Madrid. Got a nine point win here, which is uh, very pleasing. Um, but that's basically everything I want to say now. Maybe it's a bad thing for us though. Or maybe I'm not sure if it's good or bad, because the, the cup final is played at Athletic Madrid's home ground. So, I mean, it's close by because it's Madrid, but it could be an unlucky uh, place for us, because, I mean, it's uh, our rival's home ground. But we are playing Bilbao in, in, in the cup final. And of course, when it comes to the team, uh, most of the guys are available. Big injury, as you know, is Casemiro is out for months, missing the rest of the season, still out for like three more months. Uh, but other than that, every important player is uh, is fit for fight. So yeah, I, I think I should be quiet for a while now, and then we can start talking when we get our first real highlights. So you, you just sit back, relax, and enjoy this cup final. And here, wait, 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 that was a uh, misclick by me. Um, apparently, I changed the key binding for, for muting the mic. Uh, and apparently that key binding was um, the same button that did that. So I will guess I'll have to change that key bind uh, after the game. But Bilbao has the possession here, but uh, will they actually manage to create a chance? Or can we turn it around? Here's Bale. Tony Cross, Asensio, Carvalho, Bale, Asensio, and look at that. It's really hard for me to keep calm, but I know I can't start screaming right now because my voice would die. So I'm basically almost jumping up and down where I'm sitting, just trying to, to restrain myself, to not scream, to not celebrate too, too, too much. But probably you can hear from my voice. I'm very, very happy and very, very pleased with that one. But now let's. Uh, oh, something happens ASAP from the kickoff. I'm not sure if it's good or bad news. It's usually bad news for me when something happens ASAP from the kickoff after I have scored. But let's uh, let's focus now. Marcelo wins this one, so maybe it's not too bad. Tony Cross, Isco, back for Asensio. Marcelo on the left flank into the box for Ben Sema, and this is 24th goal of the season. I was looking at the ref, but no reaction. It is a goal for sure and brilliant. That must have been like two goals in a minute or something like that. Let's go with replay here. Asensio, Marcelo, Marcelo on the left flank into the box. It bounces off. I'm not sure if it bounces off defender or bail, but I don't care. It reaches Benzema. It's 24th goal of the season. It's back in business. And it's time for me to be a little bit quiet now.
we have a corner and uh, this is very bad news for us because it looks like i actually need to pause it here take a look at this all these guys are on the run attacking these guys are slacking we must have been at the same level over here during the corner but then we were just standing there thinking somebody else was going to do the work and then we have fallen behind and this could come with a costly price and yeah this is basically things that happen when you are in the lead and people start slacking and things it's okay then things like this happens luckily for us though navas makes no mistake and we are still two goals up and this highlight continues so actually maybe something bail but hey low that's very optimistic trying to go by yourself through like two plays a little bit too much optimistic here now under pressure, but Asensio, Benzema, go for Bale, Bale, Bale on the right flank, goes for Asensio, and a decent try. Decent one. Tony Cross for the free kick, far into box, Varane, clear by defense, Tony Cross picks it up, goes for all the, well, and now, I mean, we are creating chances, we, we, we need to be pleased for that. And this is chance after chance after chance, throw in here, Carvalho, Tony Cross, Asensio, Asensio, that was a screamer from Asensio, but um, a little bit too close to the goalkeeper to actually become dangerous. Isco loses possession, and I'm guessing that's the highlight. So um, the halftime whistle, I mean, we are kind of pleased, but we need lads to stay, stay focused. We can't have them doing like uh, they did where they stopped uh, running back, stopped fighting. Don't say you might be winning, but that could all still change if your performance level stop, drop. Don't let that happen. And they all agree. Brilliant. I'm not going to make any tactical changes right now because clearly I don't feel like we have to, but you never know what will happen later on. Not much going on here in the second half. Nothing at all, more or less. So I think it's time for some subs here. Maybe we can get some fresh legs onto the pitch. First, let's see if anybody. I mean, he's having a... I think actually we're going to remove him. Of course, Casemiro would have been an obvious choice here. But we're going to go with drink water since Casemiro is out for the rest of the season. But other than him, I think we're going to stay like this for a little bit longer. Because, I mean, we are playing pretty well and they aren't too tired. And then, of course, the first highlight, a long time, and it is for Bilbao. Not what we wanted to see, not at all. Now the pressure here. But we have Navas in the goal, and he makes no mistake. But we will see a corner. Now, the question is always, yeah, that was the highlight. And, uh, I mean, I think it's time for our last two subs now. No reason to wait any longer. So uh, I think we're going to remove Bale actually, just because he is a little bit injured prone. And we definitely don't want to risk him getting uh, injured for, for the Champions League final. And then other than him, um, let's go with Tony Kroos, bring in Luka Modric. That's a quality sub to uh, have on the bench. And yeah, I feel like it was so many highlights in the first half. But now on the second one, it's barely any highlights at all. Clock just takes so long. Not much going on. Asensi with a free kick though, and another decent try. But now I guess this should be the end of the game. Could, could we create something real? Uh, well, <laughs> another. <laughs> I'll say it again, another decent try. But this should be the full-time whistle. And it's official. We have won the Spanish Cup. Our second major title this season. We won the league. Now we have won the Cup. And of course, the biggest one of them all is still to be decided, and that is the Champions League title. I mean, look at the statistics here. We completed dominating things. And we probably should have been able to score more than two goals. 
But still, we want a title. We need to go passionate. And we're going to say something positive. And we want the morale really high for the Champions League final. But I am pleased, even though it doesn't sound that, because I'm really restraining myself from screaming, from celebrating, because my voice would definitely die if I did. Uh, but the thing here we want to see is that we won the cup. And uh, we won the league and we won the cup. The big, big, big thing coming up. The dream. The thing I didn't expect us to be fighting for already in the first season will happen in tomorrow's episode. And it's huge. It's a Champions League fight. Can you imagine the first season of a save? Yes, we are playing Real Madrid. Clearly, it's a, it's a little bit of an easy mode when it comes to football manager. But still, I didn't expect us to be winning both the league the cup and being there in the champions league final with with a position to win it i thought that yes maybe one title i didn't expect us to have a chance of all the three big ones uh, but that's it for this episode thank you for sharing your time with me and give this episode a thumbs up for the cup title and i'll see you in the next episode for the champions league final